Hello everybody, welcome to Towns of 505. Welcome to the channel if you're new, or welcome back if you're a lovely subscriber. Today I'm going to be continuing my top 100 album series. And uh, before I begin, I just want to give my usual shout outs. Uh, of course, thank you to the friend group of Music Junkies for watching my videos. Uh, and of course, special shout outs to Ryan Cam and Jacob Martin for not only watching these videos, but they've been listening to them as I've been going along. So thank you very, very much. I very much appreciate that so much. And, of course, uh, Scott from SoundLab Studios and Jason from JC Old Millennial. They've been doing their Top 100 album list, so check theirs out as well. So go over their, their channel and watch their Top 100 album. Not only that, but just check their channel out in general. Great videos. But uh, without further ado, let's get started. Uh, today I'm going to be doing album number 23. Tug of War by Paul McCartney. This album was released April 26th, 1982. And uh, this was his uh, this was his second album uh, in the 80s. Uh, the first one being McCartney 2, of course. And, well, this album was recorded in December of 1980, but, of course... As you may know, John Lennon was killed in 81, and McCartney stopped recording after that happened because he was just so devastated. He was like, you know, he's like, I can't make music for a little bit. I need to take a break. And totally understandable. I mean, one of his, one of his childhood friends, well, not childhood friends, but like one of his close friends died. Well, old friends died, and he was like, eh, I can't do this for right now. And he took a took a pretty much a pretty much a year hiatus after that. And then um well, another notable thing is that George Martin uh Phil actually produced this album. Uh which if you don't know who George Martin is, well, don't consider yourself a Beatle fan because he's like one of the most important aspects of what made the Beatles sound so good and to get him back in the producer spot for Paul McCartney, he shows like this is why this will always be my favorite McCartney album. I love Band on the Run, but Tug of War will always run deep with me ever since I first heard it. Such a good album. Uh, but uh, let's get right into the track list. Uh, first song of the album, Tug of War. Great, 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 great song to open up the album. Uh, definitely sets the mood of the album. It's a tug of war. Bum, 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 bum. In another world. I love, like I said, the production from George Martin. Definitely could tell difference. And man, another, such a great song. Uh, Take It Away. Oh my gosh. Always been one of my favorite songs. This sounds like it, this could have been a Beatles song. Like, this sounds like a 1982 Beatles song. It's really, really that good. I freaking love this song. Take it away. Only hear you say. Bum, 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 bum. Ah, love that song. Uh, Somebody Who Cares. A really good song. Uh, What's That You're Doing. Great collaboration with Stevie Wonder. Uh, I love that song. Uh, one of my favorites on the album. One of my favorite McCartney songs. Uh, here today, uh, another fantastic song. Uh, this is a this was the this is a tribute to John Lennon. He wrote this after John Lennon got killed. So, what a I love it. Such a great tribute to to John Lennon. I love that song. Side two opens up with ballroom dancing. I love that song. Ballroom dancing. Bum, 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 bum. Ballroom dancing. Uh, great song. Uh, the Pound and Sinking is a pretty cool production on it. Uh, another great song on the album. Uh, Wanderlust. Man, another masterpiece. Uh, love that song. Uh, get it pretty good. Not like a big highlight. Uh, Be What You See. Just a short little interlude track. Um, dress, up, dress Me Up as a Robber I really like. And uh, Ebony and Ivory, such an awesome album closer with Stevie Wonder. So two Stevie Wonder contributions, uh, both 
both my two favorite songs on the album, if I'm being honest. But uh, let's get into my top five. Uh, number five, Tug of War. Number four, Take It Away. Number, Actually, scrap that. My top five, number five, uh, Wanderlust. Number four, uh, I'm going to go with Here Today. Number three, Ballroom Dancing. Number two, Here Today. No, no, no. Uh, what's that you're doing? And then number one, Ebony and Ivory. Uh, almost made a mistake on my top five. Uh, my bad. Um, but uh, if you have any thoughts on this album, leave it in the comments below. Besides that, thank you so much for watching. And I'll see you guys next time. So long.